What is up, fellow YouTubers? So I hope you all had a wonderful Valentine's Day. I unfortunately could not do what I was planning to do due to a lack of funds. I keep asking Etsy to transfer my money on the next available day. And I ask and I ask nicely. And according to my revenue, it's $336, which would be a nice chunk of change when I get it. But right now I have $320.59. Normally, when I get money on Etsy, I can always transfer a small portion of it. I can. I used to be able to transfer a small portion of it to my bank account and then the rest would transfer some other time but now every time I go to hit schedule for an earlier deposit I just clicked on it so now it says deposits on February 15th now this morning, at very early in the morning, it was like 8 o'clock, I clicked on that same button and it told me it would deposit the money today. So I kept thinking, huh, maybe I'll get an email from Gmail saying Etsy sent you funds or some shit. And to no avail. Hmm. Shit. Now, all I'm going to do at this point is just say fudge it and keep trying until I, until I get, you know, the funds. All if it's, you know, let's see, 336. So there's like $16 that I haven't quite transferred. So I'm wondering, well, it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and that's the thing of it is I don't even know if it'll transfer tomorrow or not. At this point, I'm skeptical, you know. And if it doesn't transfer tomorrow, I'm going to have to wait two more days for it to transfer. And that's just because Etsy doesn't transfer money over the weekends. Which, that's understandable. You know. I can understand Etsy not wanting to transfer money over the weekend. Did they change something in their system? Because we used to be able to get... You know, you used to be able to get the, uh, <laughs> so I don't know what the deal is with that. And, you know, let's like I said on my last video, you know, I can't complain they're selling, you know, but at the same time, 
It is kind of frustrating how sometimes life never goes the way we want it to. We have this set goal in mind, like, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to ask a chick out or an attractive young lady out on Valentine's Day and Etsy won't give me, give you, give me the hard-earned money that I rightfully made selling my wands. I'm not particularly mad at Etsy. I'm just, you know, I'm a bit uh, questioned, questionable, you know. Questionable in a sense where I'm asking questions, you know, and that's fair because why is it, you know, and again, I'm not complaining, I'm just speculating and asking questions. It used to be where you could, like I said, if you made like 116 bucks and you wanted that money right away to get your product shipped out quicker, you could transfer that portion of the money. Now, it could be that my debit cards expired and I haven't interlocked my new one but at the same time my bank account is linked to my Etsy page privately so I don't see why it's not transferring you know, sometimes in life that's just it you got problem solving you know every reaction has a reaction so to speak so something in the, you know, I'm wondering if like when I go to hit transfer the money and then some of the money from those orders processes and then does it reset the transfer date because the amount gets bigger? If that's the, if that's the case, okay, but that doesn't make any sense, you know, why isn't it transferring, you know what I'm saying, any money at all, period. Why is it that every time I click on transfer today or transfer on the next available day like yesterday they're like we'll transfer it today didn't happen click on it again and then it said your money will be transferred february 14th thinking all right you know all right maybe you know we can pull something off here but no <laughs> Nope, still nothing. I get home and Etsy's sitting there. We'll deposit the money on the 19th. And I'm like, um, listen here, Slick. I don't want my money deposited on the 19th. I'd much rather it get deposited sooner so I can get my next batch of wands started. You know? That, that's, all, that's all I'm jiving at, man. Like, shh. I worked so hard to make a beautiful batch of wands. I told YouTube I was going to make a batch of wands before Valentine's Day, and I did. I successfully made a batch of wands before Valentine's Day. And not only did I do that, YouTube, I also got them sold and shipped out before Valentine's Day. And, you know, I'm proud of myself for that one. But, um,. It'd just be nice if uh, shit would go smoothly for once, but yeah, I guess I'm not complaining too much. So because I couldn't do, you know, what I planned on doing, I ended up helping some friends move. Like there's a friend of mine who needed help moving and literally had a shed full of shit, you know what I'm saying? So it gave me a chance to do a good deed for somebody and work out my arms. And after I got done doing that, I pretty much spent the rest of the day, with the rest of the day hanging out with friends. Yeah. There's no sense in being a depressed lump on the couch all day because it's, you know, just a holiday. And that's that's just it. It's just a holiday, you know.
excuse me. Well, I'll get my money from Etsy when I get it. It'd just be nice if they quit dicking me around. You know. If I click on something and it says your money will transfer on such and such date. And I have a feeling what's going to happen is the rest of that money will process. And then it's going to probably keep doing the same thing to me until the full amount's reached. I don't foresee it. At this point, I'm trying to be optimistic. You know it. But at this point, every time I go to hit transfer on the next available day, it will sit there and say, okay, we'll do that. And then they never do it. So, hmm. Again, again, I'm not complaining. I like using Etsy. It's a great little online shop for selling your homemade artwork and your crafts and what have you. But, um... To quote the mask from Jim Carrey, can't make the scene unless you get a little, little bit of green. I better make a little stop. I, 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 I. No, but seriously, tubes. Seriously, though. Hmm. I'm gonna crash for the evening. Figured I'd make like one or two videos and then, yeah. I know my last video wasn't very brief. The one where I'm walking outside. You know, the wind's howling. You know. I made a, I made a little bit of money helping a friend of mine move, but... And I'm grateful for for that, you know. But for me, when I take a girl out to date for drinks, I personally like to have minimum of 50 bucks or less. Like $20 if, you know, because, you know, even a reasonably priced bar can add up, you know. And the money doesn't matter, and I acknowledge that 100%. But for me, it's all about having a little bit of class. When I'm taking a chick out, you know what I'm saying? Or a young woman, whatever you want to call it. You know? I mean, you don't want to try too hard to impress her because she'll pick up on that bullshit so quickly. But at the same time, you don't want to be a cheap date because that's going to send a wrong impression as well, you know. You got to find a common ground. And the best way to do that when you're old enough to date is kind of play the scene out and, you know. You ever have one of those moments where you're just like, I need a bowl of pipe tobacco. Yeah. You know, and despite it being Valentine's Day, normally I'd complain about being single, or at least in the last couple of years I have, but, um, no, these last couple of months I've just been like, it's just not something I like complaining about, because it's just beating a dead horse at that point.
And this is something, I'll be a hypocrite for saying it, but it's not good to dwell in your um, BS, you know. If you're feeling depressed about something, all you can do is cope with it to the best of your abilities. People are definitely liking the ones that, um, that, um, that makes me feel good about it. I suppose one of these days that money will transfer. I'm hoping sooner than later because this is getting a bit ridiculous. Only time can tell, I guess. Hopefully y'all had a wonderful Valentine's Day. And now that the holidays come to pass, if you're still single, again, same mentality. If you're old enough to go to the bar and have a couple drinks, then get out there and socialize a little bit. Just because Valentine's Day is over, I don't want to hear any excuses from the ladies about nothing. None of this, I'm too fat bullshit. Get out of here with that. I don't want to hear any bullshit from the dudes either. You know. Dudes thinking they're not ripped enough. You know. Or those are just excuses, man. And if you're not old enough or you're not ready to date, that's cool too. You know. No rush. You know. We can make the most of our short time that we have on life. Create many memories and do many amazing things. And you never truly realize how short life is until it's gone, you know. I mean, I had an okay day. It wasn't the best regarding a couple of circumstances, but it could be worse. Tomorrow will hopefully be a zillion times better.